hello you are welcome to this channel and to this tutorial this is i blessing all right in this video i'm going to show you how to download more fonts to your pixel app app all right i quite understand that some few persons have been having issues downloading fonts to their pixel app and they've been asking for an updated video on this channel and this is why this video is created i welcome you here this is the updated video tutorial on how to download fonts to your pixel app app all right if the last video was created um, around 11 months to one year ago and it isn't as detailed as this i would like you to follow through this simple process and steps i'll be showing you with this you'll be able to download any font all typeface to your pixel app all right so you go to play store and make sure you have this app you are seeing on the screen make sure you have it downloaded to your device it is called z archiver z archiver well, some people call it Z Achiever, whatever you call it, Z Archiver, Z Achiever, Z Archiver, anyhow, it is just, just go on Play Store and download it. Then, every of the fonts you ever need, they are all on your Google, your Google, they are all on Google, so you go to your browser, your Chrome browser, alright, this is my um, Google Chrome browser, so you search, before you can download any fonts your pixel lab you need to know first of all which font what is the name of the font you want to download you cannot download any font without knowing the name all right first of all you need to know the name of the font there is an app that you used to, can use to know the name of any font you want to use but that's not for this tutorial so once that is known then you type in the name let's say the name of the font i want to download in this tutorial is roboto fonts so you also need to know that for google to give you what you really want you need to search with the right keyword you need to search with the right keyword so what you're going to put make sure that is in this world this thing you are searching for is the right keyword once you want to freely download the roboto font interface on your search um, search space you look for roboto font free download All right roboto font free download So Google will automatically bring into you, will suggest to you different sites where you where these fonts can be found. Different sites where you can see on Google, Google.com, fonts.google.com, you have the font, tafonts.com, you have the font, fontscurer.com, you have the font, freefontsfamily.com, you have the font, adobe.com, you have the font, wfonts.com, you have it there, 101, 1001freefont.com. A lot of it you can see that they are all there but let me say I want to make use of it from dafont.com you can use any of the sites to download it you can so far you you are you, you typed with it you search with the right keyword you have it there all right this is the dafont.com then you click on download this part here download all right So because I have it before, it's telling me if I want to download it again. And let's click on download again. I have this one before. All right. So once that's done, you open. It takes you automatically to Zakiva app. To your Zakiva app. You can see this is a very very large interface. A big family. Roboto is a very big family. You can see you have Roboto light, light italics, light italics, medium, medium italics, Roboto regular, thin, thin italic. Um. It even suggests a book for you, a PDF for you, Roboto Black, Roboto Black Italy, Roboto Bold, and a lot of it like that. But you cannot start downloading them one after the other like this. It's a way you can multi-download them. Right, so what you're going to do is to click on these three dots on top here. Then click on multi-select. Click on multi-select. Then click on this to this um, done, this check icon here. Click on it. Then click on select all. All right, click on select one, then click on this check or, or this one down here, the, the check icon again, click on it. All right, then click on this icon on your right bottom corner, all right? Once that is done, then you go back, yeah? Go back, like you are going back, you are exiting the app, go back once, wait, then go back again, then go to fonts. This is where all your fonts on Pixel Lab is. So you're going to install this also in it. 
though I have it before, so I'm not gonna click on replace. I'm gonna replace all, apply to all like files and replace all. So you can see that it's extracting, successfully extracted. Let's go. Let's now go to my pixel lab and click on it. All right, so go to fonts. definitely find it right there so let me search for roboto so you can see how i downloaded everything once it's all in my life so i want to make use of this so you can see the font is there font is there so that's that about downloading fonts and there are some fonts where that you download on your, on your from your um google chrome and when you when you get it when you get to zakiva apps will tell you that the archive is corrupt the main issue is the site where you downloaded it you don't have to be to be um afraid the issue where the where the issue is coming from is the site you downloaded it so you go back to your chrome all right you go back to your chrome browser you go to download this is when it says archive is corrupt you go to your download the list of downloaded items all right click on this and delete it yes click on the font and make sure it is deleted then go back to your chrome again and then search for the font again so you have to now then use another download from another site make sure the keyword is the roboto font free download because there are sites where they will ask you to pay so you cannot download from other sites like Fonts Squirrel, Free Fonts Family, you cannot download from somewhere else. Because the major reason why it shows archive is corrupted is from the site where you download any fonts. Now this is clear. Thanks for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Um, we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.